breaking news right now, a wild scene in Clearwater. A car reportedly tried to escape from police and crashed into a building, killing one person. You can see the car ended up there on its side. This happened at the intersection of Prospect Avenue and Chestnut Street. And that's where you find eight on your sides, Beth Rousseau at the scene for us this morning. Beth, tell us what we know about how this happened. Hey, Chris and Avery, we're actually keeping a pretty respectful distance at this point because police here are dealing with the victim that's still in the car this morning. Not only do we have the sheriff's office out here, but you can see the medical examiner is here as well. And if we go ahead and pull up some more of that video, you can again see the damage to this building, but also see the car that's turned over on its side. So the sheriff's office tells us that right after midnight, that car was trying to get away from a traffic stop. They say that's when the car crashed into the building that you see fire Firefighters working on in the video. They say one person is dead this morning and another person is seriously hurt. They're at Bayfront. So, right now, we're working with police as they try not only to get the victim out of this car, but figure out how this happened. There's a number of things we're trying to piece together along with who the victim is, how long this area will be closed off. If we come back out here live, this portion of Prospect Avenue that you're seeing is blocked off right here at Chestnut Street. You're also going to notice if you're in the area very large police presence as we get further into the morning commute if these officers are still out here you better believe it's going to cause some congestion that's why dn king has your workarounds hey d hey good morning beth and good morning everybody so just to put into perspective where this area is this morning it's right near that rita's italian ice in this area there's a walgreens not too far down the street near the intersection of the U.S. 19 alternate, also Myrtle Avenue. That's going to be one of your best alternate routes this morning. Traveling east or westbound basically to avoid prospect, your alternate route is going to be Turner Street. These alternate routes are up to speed, but again, we'll keep our eyes on this and bring you any updates as the morning progresses.